Hey y'all, it is my wash day. It is well overdue for my wash day. It is about two and a half weeks out. I've had my hair in an updo for the past three days. It's been raining here in Phoenix. It's been, yeah. So let me show you what my hair is looking like. My scalp is on fire. So one of the first things I'm gonna be doing is pre pulling my hair and lightly detangling. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not gonna detangle as well as I should because I just don't have the time. I have two hours, that includes detangling, washing and deep conditioning. I can spend two hours just detangling my hair. So I'm gonna be lightly misting my hair with warm water in this spray bottle. And I'm gonna be using an Odie But Goodie VO5 Strawberries and Cream all over my hair to kind of finger detangle. And I'm gonna be shampooing my hair and cleansing my scalp with ORSS, that's Original Root Stimulator, for those of you who don't know, Creamy Alloy Aloe Vera, excuse me, shampoo. I love this stuff. Awesome, right? And then we're gonna be using an oldie but goodie deep conditioner. We have their hair mayonnaise, and I'm gonna be using a package of the replenishing conditioner. And we're gonna add, there's already some oils in here, and then we're gonna add like one or two tablespoons of honey. When I deep condition my hair now, depending on my mood, I go ahead and skip conditioning, like a regular rinse out conditioner. I go from shampoo, jump into the deep conditioner, okay? And I will be leaving that on for about 30 minutes, okay? So let's go ahead and section my hair off and start finger detangling. guys jumping into the shower and taking down some of these hair clips now I do like to wash my hair meaning cleanse my scalp while it is in twist but sometimes girl I just can't get to it so this product goes a long way I absolutely love it it is very very creamy I am applying it directly to my scalp and to the hair in certain areas allowing the product to work its way down the hair shaft now y'all one of the advantages girl one of the few advantages of living in an area that does not have a lot of African Americans is that our products, at least products for textured hair, you can always find clearance sales or um, great deals. So I found this particular product, the shampoo at least, at my local fries just last week for only $150. So yeah, I cleaned up, cleaned up. So again, working this product down and you can see how it works well on my textured hair.
So now there is a little bit of shampoo in the front, but that's okay. We're just going to go ahead and clip this hair up and start applying the deep conditioner. This deep conditioner, I particularly love to use this particular, um, it, it could be a light protein treatment depending on your hair porosity, I will say. So I like to add oils, honey, um, the coconut suave, excuse me, the suave coconut, I should say, to make a great DIY moisturizing deep conditioner. So I'm just going ahead and taking my time. I'm going to kill the entire jar, about two cups of this mixture to my hair strands. I am going to end up um, applying a heat cap, leaving that on for about five minutes and then allowing it to sit on my hair for an additional 20 minutes or so. So this is what my hair is looking like with the deep conditioner on for about 20 to 25 minutes. Now I'm going to jump back in the shower and rinse this out. So I am done washing my hair. A good indicator for me, and most of us know by now, whether or not your hair feels soft or your curls are fine, before Z, you, you know, you argue with me in the comments, girl. But if you have some type of curl definition, if you have known for having curls, how are your curls looking? Okay, does your hair feel soft like I said? Does it feel like it's going to be able to hold some moisture? Don't add any products and how is your hair feeling? How does it look? Does your scalp feel okay? This is what the back is looking like. So yes, I'm there. I, my hair feels great, it feels healthy, it feels moisturized. Now while my hair is soaking wet, cause again, water is moisture. <laughs> while my hair is soaking wet, I will then apply my leave-in conditioner. I'm old school, I use can too. I use Cantu, don't know why I did that. I use Cantu leave-in repair cream and then I use my oil. I immediately twist my hair up because my hair will get matted. I do a little light detangling. Immediately twist my hair up. I use something that is cloth. Okay. And I'll allow my hair to dry at that point. So that is it, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you as always to all my subscribers. Take care. Bye. So here are clips from an upcoming DIY deep conditioner. I hope you guys can stick around for this. It's going to be coming up within the next two weeks or so. All right, you guys, take care. Bye.